Hey, this is Mr. W from sciencemusicvideos.com. There are three weeks to go until this year's AP Bio exam on May 18th. Because of the pandemic, this year's exam will consist of two free response questions. If you're feeling nervous and unsure about how to prepare, join the club. But if you're ready to dig in and work, there's still time to get yourself to a level where you can score a four or a five. In this video, I'm going to show you how. Let's do AP Bio Review FRQs. If you've already watched the video that I released three weeks ago with a six week plan for getting ready for the AP Bio test, and if you've been carrying out that plan, stop watching this video. Just get back to work. This video is for AP Bio students who are starting their preparation process now. Okay. Before we start, I gotta tell you, this is really a tough situation. No one has ever had to prepare for an AP Bio exam in the midst of a pandemic without direct access to their teacher. Preparing for an AP Bio exam is difficult under any circumstances. It's a hard test. This entire situation is not fair. But if you put the time in and spend your time studying the right way, you can climb this mountain and you can get to your goal a four or a five on this year's AP Bio test. The right way to practice is to simulate the task you'll face on May 18th. That task is writing two FRQs at home on a computer. The first of the two FRQs is gonna be about experimental design. Please watch my video on that topic. I've linked it below. The second is gonna be about a biological system that gets disrupted, and I'm hoping to release a video about that in the next few days. In both questions, you're going to have to explain the relevant biological concepts and processes, make predictions, and justify those predictions. The College Board has limited the scope of the exam to AP Bio units 1 through 6, but that still leaves a lot of biology. And you've undoubtedly heard that the test is open book, open note, open internet, but as I've told my own students, that's not going to help you much you're gonna to have to know a lot of biology in order to succeed. Here's an overview of how to get yourself as prepared as possible for the AP Bio exam. After I give you this overview, I'll go into the details. First, you need a practice schedule. Below, I've put a link to a page on my website. There you'll find your Biomania learning journal named for the review system on my website that I'll tell you about in a moment. This journal has a three-week schedule for preparing for the AP Bio exam. That schedule is part of a Google Doc that also is a practice journal for writing practice FRQs, and that's something you should do every day for at least an hour a day. Remember, at this point, the more you practice, the better you're going to perform. Second, you need practice materials. A lot of these will come from the College Board. They're listed in your Biomania Learning Journal. The rest come from my Biomania AP Bio exam preparation system on sciencemusicvideos.com. Biomania has 73 practice FRQs from units one through six with model answers for each one. There are also 170 flashcards from units one through six, and flashcards are a great way to study for an FRQ exam. Here's what a student who used my review system last year had to say about it. Thank you for making such useful AP Bio review materials. Without them, I seriously doubt that I would have gotten a five on the AP Bio exam. So right now, go to sciencemusicvideos.com slash subscribe and purchase a subscription. Your purchase gives you access to Biomania and to an entire interactive AP Biology curriculum. Note that you can also get access to just Biomania by downloading the Biomania app on Apple or Android. The download is free and an in-app purchase unlocks all the content for units one through six. My phone app and my website work together. You can use the interactive tutorials on sciencemusicvideos.com to fill in gaps in your biology knowledge that you'll discover from doing Biomania. And because having access to Biomania on a phone is so convenient, a lot of people get both. Now, let's talk about how to do FRQs. At this point in the year, you've probably responded to many FRQs, but I'm going to start with an obvious point. Read the prompt and respond to all parts of the question. Here's an example from page 208 of the College Board's 
course and exam description for AP Bio. I've put a link to that document below. In the question, you're asked to do four things. How do you know? The College Board has made it very easy by putting what they call task verbs in bold text. These task verbs tell you what to do. So in this question, you have to describe in Part A, then explain in Part B, then indicate using a template in Part C, and then explain in Part D. For the past three years, I've been part of a huge team of teachers that scores the FRQs on the AP Bio exams. One of the biggest ways that students lose points is by not responding to all parts of the question. In terms of what to practice, I've put links to everything you need in your Biomania Learning Journal. Here are the highlights. First, on the College Board's website, they have five years of past FRQs. They also have scoring guides. In your journal, I've identified which FRQs to work with because this year's exam is limited to just units one through six. Second, your AP Bio teacher will have access to more FRQs from the College Board's AP Classroom. Third, as part of my Biomania AP Bio exam preparation system on sciencemusicvideos.com, I have 73 practice FRQs for units one through six. I also have 165 flashcards for these same units, and flashcards are a perfect way to study for an FRQ exam. Now let's talk about how to practice. I'm going to use the practice FRQs on sciencemusicvideos.com as an example. You can find these by clicking on the Biomania menu on sciencemusicvideos.com and then clicking FRQs. Each session, use the checkboxes on the FRQ menu to limit your questions to just units one through six. Also, set the maximum number of questions to practice to 10. Once you're ready, click Begin Practice. Take a minute and read this question. Start by thinking about what the question is asking you to do. Don't write out your answer yet. Click pause until you're ready to continue. The question is asking you to do three things, even though it's a two-part question. Predict, justify your prediction, and then in part two you're asked, how would this mutation affect differentiation of the R7 cell type? That's essentially another prediction. Now, pause the video again and type out your answer in your Biomania Learning Journal. Make sure you've covered all parts of the question, and when you're done, hit play. Now, slowly read the answer and compare it to what you wrote. If you got it right, really right, then pat yourself on the back and click, got it. But if you didn't, then reread the answer. Think it through. If you can video chat with a partner, that's even better. When you're done with talking or thinking it through, click, need more practice. The way that button works is that it tells Biomania to give you that question again later in the study session. When you see it again, write it out again as if you're seeing it for the first time and see if you can come up with a more complete answer. That's it. If you watch my flashcard video, it's the same method. Slow down and take in the feedback. I strongly suggest that in addition to the Biomania flashcards and FRQs on sciencemusicvideos.com, you do the multiple choice questions. They're a great way of building up your content knowledge, and that's one of the most important assets that you'll need as you do these FRQs. So, here's your plan for success on this year's AP Bio exam. First, get set with your Biomania Learning Journal. Second, buy a subscription to sciencemusicvideos.com. Third, download the Biomania app from the Apple or the Android store, then complete the in-app purchase to unlock all of the content for units one through six. You can do this. We're all in a very tough situation, but you're gonna to rise to the occasion by putting in the time and doing your best. It's so worth it. For one thing, you'll learn a ton of biology, the best subject, but in addition, scoring a four or a five on the AP Bio exam is gonna help you achieve your other goals in life. You can make the success happen. Stay safe and take care of yourself and your loved ones by practicing social distancing. I'll see you on sciencemusicvideos.com and back here on YouTube for more videos.
Mitosis, chromosomal ride in a pro meta anatela phase divide. Eukaryotes go from one cell to two. Mitosis, how cells renew.